In this module, you will see how to do batch printing, where you can print a bunch of cards at one time with your PVC printer. We'll click on the navigator, we'll run a search. You can search on any field that is in your database. I'm going to choose first name, and assuming that everybody's first name field is being filled, I'm going to say that cardholder's first name is not empty. I will set the results so that we can print a batch of cards and click on search. Here we get our search results folder, but we also get a message asking us do we want to use the default logic that's been set up to, for your different badges, or do we have a special card designed to print for all of the selected results? I'm going to stick with the default logic and hit OK. All of these records will then be sent to the card print manager. I've opened the card print manager and all of these records that were sent to the card print manager will remain here until I select one or all of them and release them to be printed. I can select one and move it up and down in the queue using these arrows one at a time or all the way to the top or bottom. Maybe Jane is in my office and she needs her card now. I can do a force print, but I want to preview the card first. Make sure it's the correct card. So I see it's the correct card and now I can click on force print to print the card. When I do this, that just means that it will be the next card in the queue that will be printed. This is asking me, do I want to release it since I haven't? Just click yes and it will be the next card printed. The queue threshold, it's set to 4 by default. You can change it if you'd like to. It doesn't need to be changed. It just means that if I've selected all these records to be printed, the first four of them will go to my printer. And the four records will remain in the queue until all of the records are printed. With them all selected, and I don't want to print them, I can just click on Cancel.